What's going on, people? Sean Pierce Johnson here. My voice cracked on that one. That was a great, that's a day two voice crack for you. We're here on the floor of Winter Nam 2020 with the one and only Mr. Mikey Demas. And we're talking Red Beard. And we, we don't care. Honey Badger don't care. Right. We're checking out the Honey Badger. But I'm, I'm gonna check out both these pedals because I've been waiting to try them for a very long time. Tell us about the, what got you started with the idea of like, hey, I should start a pedal company. And what led to both of the pedals that you have out right now? So lightning struck my beard one night when I was uh, in Society Ow. Frazzled. I got shocked by that one. I thought someone put the idea in my head of like, why don't you do a pedal company? And I thought, well, I wouldn't even really know where to start. Like, like I was full of these, why I couldn't do it so rather than why I could do it or how I could do it. And I met a bunch of people who sort of put me on the right track to being able to do that sort of thing. And before you know it, we're at NAMM 2020 yeah. with Red Beard FX pedals. What? Yeah. And it's pretty cool because guess what Ampy's using for the demos? It's a rocker verb. So everything is good in this world. He's using a Boss Tube Amp Expander. Yeah. So basically, you guys are going to be hearing exactly what you normally hear on the channel playing these pedals for the first time ever in NAM coverage. Hopefully. I'm still getting used to this thing. So what you're hearing is coming off this thing more than the amp. So well, it's, a, it's the head, but it does anything. I think still, it's still going to sound pretty damn good. Yeah, I think it sounds OK. I'm still figuring it out. That's so we're disclaimer, 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 disclaimer. Right. <laughs> so we're going to play the Honey Badger first. So what is the Honey Badger? So the Honey Badger is a really aggressive fuzz pedal with a two band EQ, an individual bass and treble control. It's a sort of, it can go from like vintage sort of muff vibe all the way up to like really modern aggressive fuzz. And then it, the, the Honey Badger's got a switchable octave function, a foot switchable that blends between minus two octaves or minus one octave. So, and you can blend between the two and blend in how much of that you want in the fuzz signal. So it, it's kind of like blue box OC2 vibes where it's glitchy, monophonic, analog kind of, it tracks really well at some parts of the neck or on the neck pickup as well. And then sometimes you get the weird, unpredictable artifacts. Yeah, artifacts, exactly. Yeah, very artifacty, which I love. I love it too. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of got that kind of Prince, When Doves Cry vibe. Like, you just want to go play lots of single note. Just wheedly, wheedly, wheedly was as, as a little humble brag. We were checking it out beforehand, and I feel this tap on my shoulder as I'm doing wheedly woo, wheedly woo with extreme octave and fuzz effects. And I was like, "Yeah, keep going on with that." I turn around, and it's friggin' Adrian Ballou. Yeah, you get mad props. I, I, uh, like, thank you. <laughs> day, day two is done before it even started for me. But let's 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 just play this thing. Let's have some fun. Uh, let's turn the knobs and just make make a bunch of noise. these days and that thing I love I like that okay but that's not the only one we need to check out the red mist I need to uh, just give everybody the little elevator pitch of what the red mist is okay so the red mist mark four is our it was our first battle it's our take on high gain distortion amp like tone in a box it's a unique and original circuit it's not based on any existing distortion or overdrive pedal so it's kind of got its own unique thing going on but it can do everything from like a bit of a clean boost to like warm british drive up to like stupid oscillating high gain ridiculousness with active eq on bass middle and treble so you can really carve out what you want it's a bit of a beast all right let's hear the beast yeah
even need to do an outro. That's your video. Hope you enjoyed.